Good morning. Starting up with some coffee. And I'm heading out to check out some animals and go to Epcot. Today's gonna be awesome. Saw me making coffee earlier. We are all filled up on caffeine and we're heading into Epcot, the experimental prototype community of tomorrow, or also known as in the Walt days, experimental prototype city of tomorrow, or known in the cast member world, every paycheck comes on Thursday because that's when they get paid. All right, we are walking in to Epcot. They've just redone the entrance to Epcot to be more plant and natural friendly for the environment. The future is changing. You can see here we get some beautiful plants and some trees, shrubbery, gorgeous. And this walkway is pretty new too, I think. I think they rerouted everything. All right, we're heading to the entrance. One day, $130. Wow. There she is, Spaceship Earth. Glorious, grand, and miraculous spaceship. Have to get a park map. Definitely need to get a park map. And as they say, I have to get a English one because I always grab, sometimes grab the wrong one. Here we go. I'll grab one from the middle. All right, I'm here at the Flavors from Fire booth and I got the corned beef with crispy potatoes and beer cheese fondue with some cheese curds. Let's try it out. That's delicious. everything I wanted it to be and more wow this is good little dude wants out some of my chips it's all mine none for you that was so good love flavors from fire every year Delicious. Okay, I'm just coming out of the Canada Pavilion. Just saw the Canada Far and Wide show right over there. And it was a good show. I like the other one better that had uh, Martin Short in it. Also featured a lot more Canadians. So I did like it better, but they're both good. You can see the trees up top here. And La Cellier is just quiet at the moment. But uh, it's a beautiful pavilion, just like the country. I've only seen a small amount of Canada. Been to Montreal and Niagara Falls, as well as 
Vancouver, and it was all beautiful. This one here is uh, depicting Victoria Gardens and is uh, not quite as big, but I try to capture it. Got some storm clouds over here. American Adventure. We're in Italy. Let's see what they have at the Italy kiosk. Kringla Bakery is open today. It must be a weekend thing. So excited. Hey, I'm sitting here at the Norway pavilion and the Kringla Bakery is open and as you can see I got myself a Lefsa. Are you a Lefsa person or are you a school bread? Let me know in the comments below. Lefsa or school bread? I'm here at the Mexico Pavilion and I want to go inside but look at this line it goes way down there that's just to get in to the pavilion and it wraps around and back I guess I won't be going there today carry on Probably too crowded anyway. Can't really distance in there. Very busy park day today.
Disney Vacation Club member, you have access to this lounge. Uh, they offer free drinks, and I think when it's not COVID, they have snacks. But um, now it's just drinks, and they have freestyle Coke machines, so you can get literally any soda, cream soda, orange soda, root beer, Coke, Sprite, all those. And you can just kind of hang out, it's air conditioned. And you get a view of Epcot. Love it. Great place to take a break. Heading into Journey into the Imagination. Here we go. Welcome, welcome, welcome to our special drive through open house. I am Dr. Mario Cherry, chairman of the Imagination Institute. Hello, I'm your toy. Hello. The five human senses can help capture your imagination. Go, go, can I go too? Absolutely not. Uh, this is one of our discoveries, the figment of imagination. Yeah, I know all about the senses. They're sight. Hey, little dude. It's not about listening with your ears. It's about listening with your imagination. Now I've completely lost my train of thought. No, you haven't. It's over here. Uh -oh.
creation. Just got off a of figment and uh, usually this is filled with people exploring the color lab. But now, as you can see, it's empty. Sign of the times. Sign of the times. I don't know what the link is. I don't think I've ever done that. All right, to Soren. To the land. Just before the park closes. going to go and I decided to give up because it's raining outside and you know sometimes it just doesn't always work out oh, excuse me sometimes this is just the way it is and that's okay it's perfectly fine to not get on everything you want to but the rain came down a little too hard. Thank you. Of course, of course. So I'm going to end it here and continue on with my journey. Bye dudes, see you next time. Oh